So to add tag helpers to the project, we need to create a partial view for them. And not just any view, but a very specifically named view. So let me go to Solution Explorer and in the Views folder right click there, Add and add a view. And the name of the view must be underscore view imports. The name is important, it has to be named underscore view imports. The next, make sure that you create it as a partial view, so make sure that this is checked. We don't want any model, so just click add. Now we can delete everything that is generated here, which is just a comment anyway. And we need to add just one single line. And again, this is a specific line that imports tag helpers, so make sure you type it exactly as I do. So first, we'll do the add for razor syntax and then add tag helpers. And you can see that it registered tag helpers for use in the current document. But we don't want just current document, we want all documents, so that's the star, and then comma. And now we have to actually specify the tag helpers path. And the path is microsoft.aspnetcore.mvc.taghelpers. So make sure that you spell it correctly. And this is it, just one line of code, but again, everything has to be spelled out correctly. And now we can save this and start using tag helpers in our app. So let's have a look at how to use them in the countries view that we are creating.